wanted to do a quick video just to give you guys some pointers on installing the Weston HDX grill guard on a 2020 F250. Uh, the instructions that come with it are, are kind of vague and they only come with about two photos so they're not real helpful. Uh, so just a couple things I ran into that that make this a little bit easier if you're staring at the instructions and, and a little bit confused like I was. Um, so the first thing is where the tow hooks are there's just a plastic piece that covers them. You can literally just take a flat screwdriver stick it in around the edges and, and pull down pull up it'll pop out of these little grooves. Um, there's metal tabs here. I had to bend the metal tab uh, where are we at? Up here out of the way. I just put a set of pliers on it and bent it flat along with the bumper to get it out of the way or else that bracket was not going to go in there. The instructions didn't really say anything about that. Uh, the tow hooks can stay in place as you can see. Uh, so the bracket on the passenger side actually uses this top bolt and then on the other side here are these two factory bolts and goes right around right around the tow hook there and then the driver's side just uses those two bolts so you just take them out there's a metal piece in the back that both bolts go into so you have to catch that it might fall down in the bumper catch that and then put the bracket in place and bolt them back in using the factory bolts underneath uh, I had already removed this plastic piece that runs the bottom side of the bumper and when I did that there were two metal brackets sticking down that I removed um, they didn't really seem to be for anything so luckily I would saved all the bolts and everything from that uh, because that's the hardware they want you to use to install these Let me get up here to install these brackets here so they actually go on the outside of the frame there, and it's the same thing. It's it's that metal metal bracket that has two bolts built into it, and then the two nuts run right through that. You hook everything up, you leave it all loose. The four brackets leave them loose, and then you're gonna need some help. Have somebody help you lift this onto the four brackets and put everything in there kind of finger tight and then you can check it to make sure you're square uh, front to back you know side to side and everything um, and then you can even do a little bit of play so you can have it a little closer to the grill and hood or you can kind of pull it away and then bolt it up wherever you like it i have it sitting a little bit further away that way if i do bump anything it gives me a little bit more room before it would run into the front of my truck so yeah just a, a couple little help helpful tips that i wish i had had before i started this project Thanks for watching.